Before you ride, perform the pre-ride inspection as described in the owner's manual. Warning. Read, understand, and follow all of the instructions, warnings, and safety precautions in the owner's manual and on all product labels. Failure to follow these instructions, warnings, and safety precautions could result in serious injury or death. Visually inspect the vehicle looking for debris, leaks, and worn components that may impair the vehicle's operation. Pay particular attention to the radiator area for the accumulation of debris, which can cause the engine to overheat. Clean any debris that is found. Check the condition of the tires, looking for any signs of punctures or damage. Check the tire pressures and tread depth, and verify that they are within specification. Inspect the front and rear suspension for leaks, debris, and damage. Inspect the brake pads and rotors, looking for corrosion, nicks, and burrs. Remove the seat and inspect the intake system for blockage or debris and clean as necessary. Notice, do not spray water directly into the intake system, as this can result in water intrusion to the engine. Next, inspect the fluid levels. Ensure the vehicle is on a level surface before inspecting the fluid levels. Inspect the coolant level in the overflow bottle at the right front of the vehicle. Add coolant as needed. Caution: Escaping steam can cause burns. Never remove the pressure cap while the engine is warm or hot. Always allow the engine to cool before removing the pressure cap. Inspect the front brake reservoir on the handlebar for proper fluid level. Also inspect the rear brake reservoir underneath the storage compartment trim. Add fluid as needed. Remove the oil dipstick and wipe with a clean shop towel. Reinstall the oil dipstick fully and remove to inspect the oil level. Caution: Operating with insufficient, deteriorated, or contaminated engine oil will cause accelerated wear and may result in engine or transmission seizure which could result in a loss of control and serious injury or death. Add oil as needed. Caution: Do not overfill. Overfilling can result in a loss of engine performance and an oil-saturated air filter. Use a suction device to remove excess oil if overfilled. Turn the key on and inspect the headlight, tail light, and brake lights for proper operation. Sit on the vehicle and check the steering for smooth operation from full left to full right. Verify proper brake lever and pedal movement, taking note of any sticking or binding. Operate the throttle lever and ensure it does not stick or bind. Start the engine and verify the low oil pressure light is not illuminated. Stop the engine with the run stop switch and ensure the engine does not restart. For more information, see your authorized Polaris dealer or visit Polaris.com.